I moved the Flutter Flame game that was previously only working on the Windows desktop over to the web using GitHub Actions. So far I haven't noticed any problems on the web, so let's go through it. I also just upgraded to Flutter 3.7. Hopefully everything still works. I'm going to store the pages on the GH pages branch. So right now I'm on main and there's only a single branch. So I'll create a new branch for GH pages. Then I'll push up the new branch. Currently I have two branches. I just created this new GH pages branch. Let's go into settings. Go to actions. I'm going to allow the uh, workflows to write uh, permissions on this repo. I'm going to use a configuration file from Flame. So go to Docs, Platforms, and then there's Flame Web here. They have this great uh, script here for GH pages. So let's first create the dot get workflows, dot github slash workflows. dot git hub and then in here we do work flows and in here which is saying gh pages hyphen or gh pages dot yaml so let's first copy it and then in here gh pages yaml we paste it in and we put the name of the repository right here so mine is where do i have it flame underscore scroll underscore tutorial so the flame underscore for scroll underscore tutorial. Okay, it's pushed up. So Flutter create plat forms equals web. Okay, let's try it again. Add a web platform. We'll push it again. Okay, everything completed. Let's try it out. 
Okay, so in this version, I do have desktop audio. My first time trying it on the web, the, it's the size of the crow and everything looks okay. I think I'm going to get through this one. Okay, 61 seconds. Let's see what happens. Oh, well, appears to be working on the game over. Oh, let it go out of bounds. Appears to be working. Thanks for joining me. This is the ninth video on this tutorial series. Um, I'm using the likes and the subscriptions to see what what is popular and what to continue on. I'm just primarily making these to work with my daughter. So you know, if you want to give a like or something, I can use that feedback and see um, if the general public also finds these usable or not. But whatever you do, make sure you have fun as you're learning Flutter and Flame. Have a good day.